Hi guys, this is Jaika for Bedtime Story. Tonight, we have Goose Goes to the Zoo. Sophie and Goose are best friends. But Sophie is worried that Goose gets lonely while she's at school. What if Sophie found Goose another friend to play with? The two take an exciting trip to the zoo to meet some new friends. But wait, what's all that noise? Sophie and Goose are best friends. They do everything together. But there are some things that Sophie and Goose can't do together. Sophie can fly. She's not fond of Goose food either. And when Sophie goes to school, Goose has to stay home. Sophie worries that Goose is lonely when she is at school. Perhaps Goose needs another friend to play with too. Sophie wonders where she can find a friend for Goose. Then she has a marvelous idea. The zoo. There are all sorts of strange noises coming from inside the zoo. But Goose isn't scared. So together, they go through the gates. And into the zoo, Sophie finds a big spotty giraffe. He seems nice and friendly, but he can fly no matter how hard they try. Goose sees a smiling crocodile in the pool. Perhaps he could be Goose's new friend. But he likes the wrong kind of Goose food. Sophie and Goose find some pink birds. But they don't seem to do much. Oh dear, poor Goose. Then Sophie and Goose hear a familiar sound. Honk, 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 honk. Look! Lots of geese, just like you. They ask Goose to fly with them. And they share a snack. They seem like very good company. Sophie's glad Goose has found some new friends to play with. She is happy for Goose. Really, she is. And Goose likes his new friends too. But there's no friend quite like Sophie. So they went back and they played together. And that is our bedtime story for tonight. See you again tomorrow for another bedtime story. Thank you and see you!